Well, hello, everybody. Hey, uh, I thought I'd point out one thing in uh, Windows 7 professional version. When If you uh, go out and get a copy, now I don't know if this is the case on OEM uh, versions, but if you go out and buy a computer and Windows 7 professional is already installed, they might have already done this. But if you go out and buy your own copy, and even in, on some OEMs, it might be the case, Games are not enabled by default on Professional uh, anymore in Windows 7. I don't know what on earth they were thinking. People have been sitting around in offices playing solitaire for about as long as I can remember now. But anyway, I noticed this when I bought my copy and uh, a lot of people might think, well, geez, I guess they don't include games anymore. Uh, but they're here and all you have to do is go to control panel programs and features and over to the left here there'll be a link that says turn windows features on or off click that and uh, you'll come up with this box here and then you can expand games and check any game you want click OK and it'll enable the games that you want. So then you can go back into your start menu and there will be an entry that says games and any games that you uh, enabled will be right there. So that's how to enable games on Windows 7 professional version. You guys have a good day. Hey guys just one side note on this uh, how to turn games on. If you're sitting in an office right now watching this and your employer does not have games turned on there's a little shield right here next to turn windows features on and off on or off and what that means is you need administrator privileges to do this so if you click on this turn windows features on or off and you get a prompt that says type in administrator password and it won't let you do it um, then you need to have a talk with your uh, employer or your IT department because they've uh, they haven't given you, given you administrator privileges and they don't want you to play games so that's just a little side note if you're having problems at the end of this video I thought I'd throw that in because I know people are going to run into that. So on that note, sorry if this didn't help you and you don't have administrator privileges, but uh, get back to work.